So today I'm gonna be doing 12 pubs of Christmas. Ryan's gonna be more of a spectator. He's been sober for a while. Here are the list of pubs made by Calvin. Here is the rules at all the pubs that we're gonna be going to. If you break a rule, you have to do a shot. That's your forfeit. This may be 12 pubs of Christmas, but to me, this feels more like a competition. A friend of mine, Sean, that I've known for 10 plus years, he's never came out with us to go clubbing or go to a pub until Sonic, my Swedish PlayStation friend, came all the way from Sweden, all the way to Ireland. I made a video about it. That was the first time Sean ever came out. And now Sean is thinking that he can beat me in this drinking challenge of 12 pubs. I'm a lightweight. I'll be real. I'm not going to lie to the camera. But since Sean wants to challenge me, I'm either going to black out, get sick, die before I lose this 12 pubs of Christmas challenge. I'm not losing today. I am the underdog. My girlfriend Toya, she doesn't believe in me. Calvin, Ryan, they don't believe in me either. They're doubting me, but I'm going to push myself to the limits today and I'm going to make sure I win. Main event, me versus Sean. There he is. The man that thinks he's going to beat me. I don't think I know. No, this is not true. I will give him my all. My all. It doesn't matter. Uh, you see, I'm currently recording the loser right now. I'm, I'm recording you now because you're going to oh, lose. Yeah, 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 you can't even yeah, look yeah. at the camera because you know what Cause time it is. <laughs> It is really bright, I'm not gonna lie. So we got a taxi, headed into town, and arrived at the first pub. This was three days before Christmas, so as you can imagine, it was very busy. But it was a very vibey pub. I've been here before, so I knew. To make this as fair as possible between me and Sean, me and Sean had the exact same drinks the entire night. In this pub, I was drinking Budweiser, so Sean was drinking Budweiser too. The rule of this pub was to use your left hand to drink your drink. That was pretty easy, so there was no forfeits given here. The second pub was called The Norseman. I've never been here prior, but I would say it's more of an old person pub. I think me and Sean got Orchard Thieves at this pub. I can't remember. They all look the same. But this pub gave us problems. This pub gave us forfeits. So keep in mind this pub rule is no swearing. Right fucking, oh, I got cursed again. I actually swore so much that for the sake of my bank account and for the sake of me not dying in the second pub, we decided that you can only fuck up one time in each pub. So if I curse twice, in this case scenario i only get one shot instead of two and so on and so forth for the rest of the challenges ryan done me dirty and he keeps making me curse i cursed at him because he kept saying that i'd lose the 12 pubs and we were only two pubs in so i was snapping i have to do a shot but i wasn't the only one because sean fucked up right after <laughs> all right boy we even now yeah. We're even now. Just completed the second pub. We're going on to the third one. And we arrived at the third pub. Never been in here prior, but it was packed just like every other pub. It was a pretty cool pub though. Like I preferred it more than the Norseman. Me and Sean got cars light. Can't remember the last time I tried one before this, but I can't even remember what it tasted like in the third pub. That empty course cup is mine. I finished my drink really fast. Like this is my cup. This is Sean's cup. <laughs> the rule of this pub was that you're not allowed to say any of your friends' names. And that's where Ryan fucked up but tommy i thought you said that ryan is sober what's his punishment gonna be that is a good question me since he doesn't drink alcohol he had to have a shot of ketchup get that into you since you're sober get that into you start drinking Nothing better than a pint of water after doing a shot of ketchup. <laughs> Look at Calvin's face. He just drank a Sambuca because he fucked up. I also fucked up, so here's me bringing my Sambuca to the table. But you're here to witness it, so... <laughs> <laughs> not for long buddy and it's the fact that i'm the one that made him fuck up this time as well <laughs> i caught that boy out that was too warm, was it? but i thought sean said he was too what up yeah shut up dk come on you better come over here boy come and do that shot do that shit that were 2-2. Two, two. How's the Sambuca? Oh, jeez. Bro sounded like Marty. He was like, ah, oh, jeez, Rick. <laughs> two riots. We have to get a picture of him. This guy just started talking to us, and Calvin and Ryan were like, what's your name? And then the guy goes, Ryan. And then Ryan goes, oh, no way. My name is Ryan, too. They both have mullets and they both have mustaches, so it's kind of mad how they're both called Ryan, too. <laughs> and just when you thought things couldn't get any stranger, I went up to two randomers and asked if I could have a pull for their cigar for the video. Just waking up in the morning, I'm on demon time. Yeah, don't inhale, don't inhale. Yeah, these guys are correct. You're not actually supposed to inhale the cigar smoke. You're just supposed to take it in, hold it in your mouth for a bit, and then exhale. You don't actually inhale it once it's in your mouth. I had to look this up. I've never smoked a cigar before, bro, until now. I didn't fucking know. So everyone ended 
ended up breaking the no names rule. That's actually crazy. But all of us finished our points in that pub, so on to the next one. Welcome to the Badass Cafe, the place where we had to do the accent rule. So I tried to use a Nigerian accent like this instead of speaking in my noble voice. For someone who actually has Nigerian in their blood, I do a horrible accent. Not going to lie. Four drinks in, I'm already finished. I'm already gone. It's already bad. It's already not looking good. It's not looking good. It's not looking good. Oh. I know my ancestors are just looking at me like. I love your confidence. My mom is just watching this video thinking. Oh my God, bro. I got an orchard thieves in the badass cafe and oh, the worker already took the cup back because I finished the drink that fast. I already finished it. Four pubs and I already finished it. Bang. And the dirt is gone. The rivalry between me and Sean was still ongoing. Yeah, come on. He's on his knees begging for no shots. I'm like... We're still doing shots. Second still doing shots. Pull, pull. You can't have the As we were walking to the fifth pub, I got noticed by two people who have watched my videos in the past. Yo, shout out to the boys, man. They know me when I'm doing 12 pubs. Shout out to the man there. I'll get you in the vid for sure. Love, bro. Love, bro. Love, bro. Love, bro. My son, bro. Love, love, love. Foggy Dew was supposed to be our fifth pub, but there was problems. We did not get into the Foggy Dew, so we have to yeah. improvise. We have to change plans. We got into the Trinity Bar venue instead, and this bar was pretty cool. There was a big TV that you could look up at, and the TV had camera footage playing, so you could look at yourself on the TV, and it was pretty cool. If we're going to change pubs, not by our choice, then we may as well change the rules as well, right? There was a rule here that was like Christmas songs rule. That rule's pretty fucking shit, so we just changed that to you have to hold your drink in your hand the whole time like you can't put it on a table you just have to hold it in your hand the entire time there is my finished cup thanks to the last pub we were at i just realized that i'm fucked so i just tried to drink every drink as quick as possible after that regardless of the taste like the taste didn't even matter anymore that is officially five pubs out of 12 everybody's dealt with me they're saying i can't do it i'm in the toilet i'm gassing myself up because i'm doing it i'm good i'm vibing i'm good i'm feeling fresh you gotta have confidence if you don't have confidence you have none so you gotta believe in yourself always even when you're lacking believe in yourself even when there's no reason to believe in yourself back yourself because you know they're gonna make it and if you don't make it you try again as nick ater he said never back down never walk never back down never walk never back down never give up oh god sean is finished he's not beating me he's already done if i'm the finished what are you <laughs> that's I'm the face of a finish man if i'm Finished, you're dead. I'm fine. Us not being allowed going to Foggy Dude just fucked up the entire list. Like, instead of being in Hogan's, we're in fucking Dave Turning Pub. Which, after a quick Google search, I'm pretty sure it was the damn Tavern Pub. This pub. This is what looks most familiar to me. Well, the damn Tavern, aka the Dave Turning, it's fucking dark and small anyway. So it's shit. The rule for this pub is to drink from somebody else's arm. So there's no better arm to drink from than Sean's arm, my fucking rival right now. <laughs> Give me more. Give me more. You want more, bro? Give me more! Give me more! It's gone! It's gone! It's gone! I finished my drink! Go on, boy! Drink up! Boy. Yes, lad. Six bobs in and I'm not losing. I'm the GOAT. I'm flying very well when it comes to drinking. I am the best. It's time to go. All right, we're on the way to the seven pub. I would play this audio to you, but it's just me calling Sean a pussy multiple times, which I've already done throughout the entire video. <laughs> so instead of going to P-Max, we went to a bar. The name of the bar was literally called the bar with no name. The list is fucked. Like when you look up the Google Street View, it's literally just a snail. It's crazy. <laughs> this pub had cozy vibes. It felt like the upstairs of someone's house. You know what I mean? It felt like if you just went upstairs into someone's apartment block and they were just throwing a party. Just cool vibes. You're losing. You're losing. You're not you're not yet. 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 I ain't gonna lie, bro. Speaking facts. Like I just don't watch football anymore. But when you ask me what team I support, I'm gonna say United, United, United. The rule for this pub was no toilet. So I looked at my drink and said <laughs> Fuck you! 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 Fuck
fuck yeah! The A pub is a compliment pub. I'm so drunk right now. Excuse me, what's the name of this pub? Sorry. So it turns out that we went to P-Max on the 8th pub instead of the 7th pub. That is genuinely a surprise to me. I didn't think we went at all. <laughs> this pub is called P-Max. And I had to compliment someone in this pub. And since I have a girlfriend, I'm not going to be complimenting any girls. So I went up to some fella. Yo, bro, you have a nice haircut. You have a very nice haircut. See, I complimented him. I complimented him. Back your drink, bro. Back it, back it, back it, bro. Bro, be a pussy. Is that a point? Is that a point? Light work! Houston, we have a problem. For pub number eight, the rule was supposed to be that you have to give somebody a compliment. I gave somebody a compliment, but just like Calvin and Sean, I also took a selfie with somebody as well. We were supposed to do the selfie rule for the 11th pub because that Guinness rule is just ass, to be honest. <laughs> but I think Calvin and Sean were so drunk that they just done the selfie rule early. <laughs> sure, Sean took a video instead of a selfie. <laughs> I don't really know if Cal's selfie counts either because Ryan and his girlfriend Megan are in that picture. So it's not really strangers that you're getting a selfie with. But it does have strangers in the picture. 2K said that live in the flesh. This guy is drunk as fuck. I said I'm doing 12 pubs. Oh God, I'm doing 12 pubs. Fuck this guy right here. I'm doing 12 pubs. He's not on it. He's not on it like I'm on it. He doesn't have the passion like We tried to make the Harry Lemon our ninth pub, but you know how that goes. We couldn't get into the Harry Lemon. We go to a different pub. They said I was too busy. I'm still vlogging. Eight pubs in and I'm still vlogging. I handle it like I can. I'm here. Ryan and Sean had to go to toilet, so we stopped by a five, guys. Sean is dying for a piss. It's one person. Ryan already went. I'm completely fine, though. Me. The Snug Bar is our new ninth bar. I don't even need to show you the original list. The list is fucked. Let's be honest. Honest, like same thing for the rules because the rules are in the bin as well apparently <laughs> i'm at that stage where i don't even know what my drink is boomers boomers i'm a boomer at the snug i can't even hack it bro where we at we're in the afterlife <laughs> we're dead we're in heaven bro I just fell he fell on his ass i wouldn't fall he fell this is my cup here sean is on his on his 10th cup he can't do it bro cannot do it come on sean drink it drink it come on do it. Come on, don't give up. Don't give up. Never back down, never give up. Nick A30, never back down, never give up. At this stage, bro just went into rest mode. He is asleep on the table. I knew I could do it. I knew I could win him. I knew I could defeat him. It's all about the mindset. Sean didn't have the same mindset as me. So Sean is asleep. Sean just gonna do it like I got it. So there you have it. We done nine pubs instead of 12. Because obviously we needed to get Sean home because look at him. He's still one of my best friends at the end of the day. Like we had to make sure he got home safe. Here's the list of pubs we actually done. Here's the list of rules we actually done. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, you see, I'm currently recording loser right now. I'm, I'm recording you now because you're gonna oh, lose. Yeah, 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 you can't even look at the camera because you don't.